We are about 30 miles from the Sequoia National Forest. We are almost to Fresno, Southern California. We're going to give you a, re a report, review of this RV park, RV bend, and uh, river bend. River bend. So the reviews were pretty high, but we're going to take a ride through here and show you and uh, see what we think. River bend RV park outside of Fresno, California. Let's see what we got. Well, there's lots of trees, shade, green grass, little game area, pull into the office. Bathroom slash laundry room, little play, playground. Groundskeeper didn't look very happy with us. He didn't want to wave or smile. And here's your office check-in. Now as you're at the office, look out here, there's a river that runs right behind the park. It has some flooding right now, so you cannot get the sights that are back up to the river. There is a trailer park right on the other side. So as we left the office, we made our first left. Got a little basketball court, a little picnic area next to the playground. The river over here to our right. A little close up of the game area. A little cornhole. So as we look back towards the office and playground area, you see that there is a river. This river runs between the campsites and the RV park. The river is actually way overfilled right now. There's usually a small creek, I guess, that runs behind here. You can see they've got it dammed up and all these sites are actually closed down from the flooding. Now this is supposed to be a spawning river for trout and somewhere on the other side of this flooded river is a small lake for trout fishing. They do have some barbecue grills, nothing fancy, but it gets the job done. They could pour a little foundation under this and maybe put some petrostone around it, make it a little nicer, but Anyway, that works. This is your dog park over here. Okay, here's the dog park entrance. I've never seen one this overgrown before. Just uh, kind of a mess. Looks like you're walking your dog in the Legend movie. Like Sam might be in there. Anyway, I'm assuming it's because of the flooding they've had recently and they just haven't been keeping anything up. Hopefully you come here later in the summer, you're not gonna deal with that. So there's a key code to get into the bathroom. And then the bathroom itself is actually really nice. So give us some credit that in the summertime or further into the summer, hopefully the outside uh, cleans up also. Laundry also has the key code and the laundry room itself, also nice. Okay, so that wraps up this video of this RV park. Now let me tell you, personally, this, this uh, campground isn't anything like what we expected. From what we expected, this was gonna be like nice landscaping and uh, all the grounds kept really nice maybe possibly padded spots or gravel spots. Some fishing areas, obviously that's flooded, but it looks like they haven't maintained it in a long time. The, the electric box, when we flipped it up to plug it in, it fell off. The, uh, the grass, it doesn't look like it's cut very often. Some of the concrete that was there on a concrete area site, the concrete is busted. There is one site, I believe it was 128 for handicapped, and that is concreted. But uh, yeah, it looks pretty run down. Don't take my word for it, because maybe it's just because of the flooding they had had and they haven't been doing much upkeep. And maybe next month, they're gonna come through here, do all the landscaping, spruce everything up, and make it look brand new again. But as of right now, it's kind of rough. All right, thanks for watching, and we will see you on the next trip further west. And as we're pulling out this morning, it looks like they are starting their cleanup. This is where this GoPro, the old 